is Christ in you? Fifth Sunday in Lent, a short worship for the week of 26 March 2023. Lent approaches its closing. During this week of Lent, we continue our journey towards God. Lent is a time to center our attention on Jesus as we remember his life and ministry to open our hearts and lives to let Christ live in us. We are to sharpen our focus on our our lives in relationship to Jesus. We are encouraged to turn away from whatever distracts or blocks our commitment to discipleship. We have received a specific call to radical generosity and spiritual discipline. Paul's reminder of Christ in us, Romans 8, verses 9 and 10. You are not in the flesh, but in the Spirit, if indeed the Spirit of God lives in you. And if Christ is in you, though the body is dead because of sin, the Spirit is alive because of righteousness. Our Modern Call to Service Doctrine and Covenants 163 verses 10 and 11 Collectively and individually, you are loved with an everlasting love that delights in each faithful step taken. God yearns to draw you close so that wounds may be healed, emptiness filled, and hope strengthened. Do not turn away in pride, fear, or guilt from the one who seeks only the best for you and your loved ones. Come before your eternal Creator with open minds and hearts and discover the blessings of the Gospel anew. Be vulnerable to divine grace. God is calling for a prophetic community to emerge, drawn from the nations of the world characterized by uncommon devotion to the compassion and peace of God revealed in Jesus Christ. Through divine grace and wisdom, this faith community has been given abundant gifts, resources, and opportunities to equip it to become such a people. Chief among these is the power of community in Christ expressed locally in distinctive fashions while upholding a unity of vision foundational beliefs, and mission throughout the world. There are many issues that could easily consume the time and energy of the church. However, the challenge before a prophetic people is to discern and pursue what matters most for the journey ahead. A Lenten prayer as we approach the closing of this season's Lenten journey. 
God of new life, our journey through a Lenten wilderness nears its end. Our journey through the wilderness towards peace often feels like a circle folding back on itself with the same problems and struggles. The path ahead often looks bleak and we yearn for peaceful moments from our past. Yet there is a river in this wilderness, a river you provide. Grant us courage to be a prophetic people, speaking hope to the despondent, sharing love with the discouraged, and standing beside the dispirited. We must look to the light and reflect the light if we are to pursue peace. Strengthen us to not run from this wilderness, but instead to cultivate life and peace with that river right where we are. In the name of Jesus, the Hopeful One. Amen. Go forward in courage. Reflect the light of Christ in you. God bless.